day 21 of the Summer of Wonder, three whole weeks on the road. And here we are at Teepee where we're going to enjoy a day of shopping downtown, woo, as well as just enjoying everything that Teepee has to offer up here. There's honestly not a lot on the agenda today. So a day of relaxing and looking forward to horseback riding tomorrow and then taking off for my next book signing. Enjoy the day. Ooh, so we climbed a mountain. Max and I are on top of it right now and just looking out over TP and just enjoying a, another beautiful morning. I was just thinking about how this is getting to be normal. This um, beautiful views and perfect weather and although it's cold, but it's great. I've been gone from home for a long time and I feel like, oh my gosh, I'm taking it for granted just a tiny bit. I'm going to try really hard not to do that today and just really take in all the smells and sights and you know I always have that prayer in the morning of Lord keep me in the moment help me live with my eyes wide open because I don't want to miss what you have for me um, and I, I just need another reminder of that every day every day I have to remind myself it's so easy to fall into just being reckless or careless or just not paying attention. I mean, how can you not pay attention? It is just, I'm surrounded by the most magnificent beauty every day that I'm out here. And yet somehow I'm taking it for granted. Come on. I'm ready to go and have a cup of chai and be really appreciative of the fact that I can just plug in my frother this morning and make it in a nice warm kitchen. Here's to a great day and part of a great day that's going to be spent in downtown Sheridan doing some shopping. I'm ridiculously excited about going back to town and this time without Lexi and poking around and just really enjoying the shops and talking to people and seeing my book in a couple of stores. So that'll be super fun. Well, she's fired up this morning. It's really cold and she found a stick. Well, this is a different view of our cabin. Not our cabin, but my friend's cabin. But it's her little cabin in the woods at Teepee. Such a beautiful setting. Definitely has become one of my favorite places ever. So now we are headed down the mountain into the beautiful, very authentic western town of Sheridan, Wyoming. My friend Erin and I started out our afternoon at the Cowboy Cafe with a delicious meal that included a little bit of homemade sangria. From there we headed over to Rooster's Gift Shop to check in on them and see that my books are being displayed in their store. Just really kind of a surreal experience. My friend Aaron's favorite store in town is Jackalope Ranch, and I totally saw why. I love the interior, the industrial feel. And she had such a variety of amazing clothes and gifts and the kind of place you wanted to just settle in and stay for a while. No trip to downtown Sheridan is complete without stopping in at King's Saddlery. The King family has been around in Sheridan for a hundred years and they have been making ropes and saddles and tack, all the things that horses need. I especially enjoyed the sleigh bells. I love the fly shop of the bighorns. It makes me think of my dad and growing up watching him fly fish and their logo is just really cool with the Wyoming flag with the fly fisherman on top of the buffalo. They even have a few copies of There's Wonder Around the Bend in their store. How about that? We ended up our trip at the Mint Bar. Not that I normally hang out at a bar in the middle of the afternoon, but this was a special occasion. The Mint has been around for almost a century as well. It's such an iconic place in town. And I have to say that Manny the bartender really knows how to make a Bloody Mary right down to the pickled asparagus spears. Erin and I ended our day back at the cabin, enjoying another beautiful evening. Thanks so much for coming along for the ride today. Please like and subscribe at Wonderbank Travel, and we'll see you back here tomorrow for day 22.